Beginning Friday, masks will be optional in all Miami-Dade County schools. The school district loosened its mask protocols for middle and high school students last week. Now they'll do the same for elementary and K-8 through centers. CBS 4's Ashley Dyer is live outside Miami-Dade School Board headquarters. The school board building to continue our team coverage. Ashley? Keep the mask or ditch them. Parents, that decision is now up to you. We talked to two sisters today who have contrasting opinions. One of them can't wait to get rid of her mask, while the other tells me she'll continue wearing hers. I don't like my mask. Maya Tarr is counting down the days, waiting for Friday and her mom's permission to hopefully stop wearing her mask. I think everybody in my class is going to not wear a mask. Everybody's not going to wear a mask. And as of today, we have about 9,020 parents who have opted uh, their children out, out of the mandatory uh, mask mandate. Maya says she's ready to get back to normal and to see her friends' faces. It's going to be awkward because I haven't seen their faces in a long time. Because a lot of my friends, some of them I don't see because I eat my lunch in class and I see their faces then, but that, then that's it. But with masks being the new norm in schools for so long now, Maya's younger sister, Leanna, is a little worried to stop wearing hers. If you take off your mask, then you, there's more chance of getting the COVID, so I want to wear my mask. The girl's mom tells us it's going to be a family decision and one that might not happen right away. I think if they're used to it, it'd be nice for them to maintain them. They haven't had colds in a long time. If they can avoid any other, you know, transmittable diseases, it would be wonderful. Miami-Dade County Superintendent Alberto Carvalho says this decision was carefully vetted and based on six different protocols, including the number of COVID cases in our community and in schools, as well as vaccination numbers. 63% of our children uh, having been fully vaccinated and 83 percent having been administered at least one dose has been on average less than 20 less than 20 cases district-wide over the past five weeks Carvalho says should there be a surge in COVID-19 cases, they are prepared to quickly adjust. But for now, they're optimistic. We're live in downtown Miami. Ashley Dyer, CBS 4 News.